Oh, well, that's the wrong one, Logan. That's the one for the police. Unless you're a police officer. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Yeah, that's for the police officers. Go run, run. That's not running. There you go. <laughs> oh, it's okay. We we we're giving them to Christians. We want Christians to look at them because they have a good moral opinion. In other words, they think abortion's wrong, right? but they don't take any good moral action. In other words, they do nothing to help make it illegal. So this talks about how we could actually make it illegal in Texas. So it's the number one cause of death in Texas, over 60,000 every year. Wait a second, you don't know what I do. Well, I know, the, judgment. I know the fruit of the land, and the fruit of the land is 60,000 every year, and it goes unopposed. Right, we know the statistics. It's right. grossly horrible. Right. Yes, we, we couldn't agree with you more, but right. you don't know what we do. Well, may I ask you, what do you do to help make it illegal? Well, um, illegal? Yeah, no. Nothing. Not, not illegal. Right, that's what I'm saying. Like, this pamphlet talks about how we can make it illegal. Right. You know? Yeah. So. So. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Logan, give it to her. Give it to her. See, you're apathetic. You don't even care about how to make it illegal. You just told me no. You just told me no, you do nothing to make it illegal. So you're just like a normal pro-lifer that's okay with regulating when, where, and how you can murder babies. And not only that, but the gray hair men and women of our community have lived with child sacrifice over 40, over 40 years. I am judging you. You're guilty. You judged yourself. How wicked is it to know the Bible but to do nothing that it says? Nothing. Yeah, thumbs up. Try that before God. <laughs>